Morning people. And what a lovely day it is. It's going to be a really nice weekend, isn't it? Yeah, see whether it will be. Do that button up there, I think. It's not the top button. Might do it later when it gets a bit hot. If it does. Yeah, but no, it's a really nice morning. So, stayed up to about one o'clock last night. Nightmare. Trying to get yesterday's vlog up. And I ended up getting that up, which was good. So that's all good. But I was doing, I was doing another video as well. I was doing that, uh, I was doing the um, thingy. And I didn't get in till, didn't get in till nine. I'm gonna watch Big Brother, as usual. I'm a bit pissed off about Big Brother because they don't put no one pissing normal in there no more. They've always got to have something, ain't they? You know what I mean? I mean, I know it's obviously they've got to make it exciting, but it's always gay or this or that. I've got nothing, nothing against gay people at all. But there's always someone gay in there. There's always someone this. There's always someone that. At the moment, they look like a proper bunch of pricks. Some good-looking birds in there, no? But that's the whole point. You know what I mean? I thought when the when the first uh, when the last one went in there, then again there's another six going in there tonight. So who knows? Apparently there's a blue a, a beauty vlogger going in there. I wonder if it's Zoella or someone like that. That'd be interesting if she goes in there. Definitely. Yeah. But um. Yeah. I mean, normal one is that. Uh, I can't think of it. The the, uh, the black girl that went in last. But yet again, she's done a cover with Kylie Minogue and she's done this, she's done that. So really, technically, although she's not famous, she kind of is. Or she was for a little bit, say. You know what I mean? It's just... I don't get it. Why can't just a normal person go in there? Like, not me. Why can't I go in there? I've always wanted to go in there. I'd go in there, but I've never applied, so... You never know, I might apply next year. That'd be funny, wouldn't it? I don't know if I'll be able to do it now, being away from it. Ooh. Nearly dropped it then. Uh, I don't know if I'll do it being away from the kids in Stace. I don't know if I'll be able to do it. It'd be a nice little break. Now, I don't think I could do it. It's like three months or something like that, isn't it? So, I don't know. I might have a look. As soon as them six go in there tonight, I might have a look. Put a bet on straight away. Get some decent odds out there. Um, see who's, see who's going to win. But yeah. Now the only sort of, sort of number one is that, um, I can't think of her name. But yeah, it's the last one in the black lady. But yeah, there you go. Let us, uh, let us know if you're watching Big Brother. I do like a bit of Big Brother. Celebrity Big Brother was good last year. But yeah, we will see, won't we? But yeah, it should be quite good that another six people are going in there tonight. <coughs> oh dear, oh dear. Can't get this light right on this phone. It's any trouble about this S5. It's not in the greatest on light. I don't think they all are, but there you go. Such is life. Well, off to work now. It's Friday. Will it be a busy day? That's a nice bike. Not chained up. Silly people. Why not put it in there? That's where I put my bike. Inside the store. My bike's not even that great. But there you go. Out for another bike ride tonight. Days of hope are going to come out. What the fuck was that? Yeah, Daisy will come out, Paul's coming out. Get, uh, Darren's coming out tonight. Get Bert out as well. Al Neil Bert, he'll probably come out as well. Robbie Bristow, he might come out. Yeah, it's gonna be a nice night for it. And next week we're gonna bike down to Hart, uh, not Hearty Ferry, uh, we probably will do it at one point. Bike down to, um, Sea Salt one night next week. Have a drink in the old sportsman in. 
yeah, it should be mad. That that'd be a nice ride, especially if it's like this one night. Well, cool as falls into the night. So I had a little buying spree last night. I bought them lights there. They're all right. They sort of clip over like that. They do. Three pounds seventy. So well cheap. And then I brought these. They're cool. They're like um. They uh, screw in your um. Your air, you, where you put the airs in the tyres, and they glow up as you go around. That's quite cool. And I bought some from China as well. I bought three sets from China as well, and also bought that, um, which is quite cool. We we'll go into that. Have a look. So yeah, it's got like a pouch underneath, keeps your phone on top as well, and it's all this bit here clips round your round your uh, main bar. Yeah, no, it's quite good. So there you go. And you can still use it for the thing as well. But that was quite good actually. Might even do a review on that actually. It's quite good actually. Quite like that. I think that was it. I think that was all I bought. Yeah, that was all I bought. But yeah, so I had a little buying spree last night, which was all right. Hello. So I just went next door. And I bought 10 jeweled multipliers because I fancied it. And the uh, second one I got was that. Look at all them winners. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. So that's 40 quid there. And then another one, tenner, five are doubled. And then another one, two pound doubled, three pound tripled. Another tenner. And then, two pound, result. So that was a nice bit of a result. Nice little uh, 62 quid there. So it is saying like 85 million pound jackpot in the Euro tonight. So I'm gonna buy 10 of those, so that's 20 quid. Yeah, I can have a little pop at them. Nice little pop at the Euro. Do you know what, I think the most I've ever won in the Euro is about 68 quid. Crazy, really. That's what I don't like about the euro. Shit wins, really. Yeah, I'm gonna buy. I'll buy ten euros and I'll buy two thunderballs. Yeah. And I might buy another twenty pounds worth of scratch cards because the new ones, the new five pound ones are out. So I might go over Sainsbury's later to see if they got the new two pound because there was a couple of ones still empty. So have a look at that. Won't we? Yeah, it's not been a bad day so far. Done an iPhone 5. Um, what else have I done? iPhone 5, couple of phones sold. Case. Yeah, got another iPhone 5 coming in this afternoon. Very nice. Gonna have to make a Saturday order now, which is gonna cost me a tenner. I'm not quite sure what the old boy's like on a Saturday. I don't wanna, if I make an order, actually, I might make an order and just go and pick it up. Yeah, I'm gonna go and make an order and pick it up. That's what I'm gonna do. Gotta go. Just got home. <clears throat> Stacey's at a party with Molly and Isabel. It's one of her friends from school, one of Molly's friends. So I'm just doing my dinner. What a lovely night out there. Proper lovely. Nice, nice weather. Little bit of a breeze. Oh, mate. Proper lovely. If it was like that all year round, I wouldn't moan. But yeah, nice. Very nice. Um... <clears throat> just do myself some pasta um, when I find some bowls. Yeah, do myself some pasta <clears throat> for uh, for dinner, and then we're going out at seven o'clock for a bike ride. And then I think Paul's home with me, and we're going to uh, we're going to sit and because we're going to pick up some stock because it's Saturday tomorrow. <clears throat> and I could have had a Saturday delivery, but it was like uh, a tenner. And the bloke said, I can drop it around your house at 7 o'clock in the morning for you, because I know the delivery bloke, which is really nice of him, but I might not be up at 7 o'clock in the morning, especially if we have a bad night. So yeah, I, don't, I said, nah, I said, you're all right, mate. I said, cheers for that anyway, no? Because otherwise he wouldn't, I wouldn't have got to meet him 12, and I need all the, I actually need all the parts. Um, I need two of the parts tomorrow morning, so, yeah. But, uh, yeah. 
No, so I'm going to pick them up from Stevie Boy, the bloke who uh, owns the warehouse where I go. He lives in Sittingbourne. It's only down the road from me, so I ain't really worried about that. About 10 miles away. Yeah. So, that's all good. Does it look really nice evening. So, yeah, we're going out for a bike ride um, at 7 for about an hour. I said to Steve that we'd be there for about half eight, so did about 45 minutes last night and did about five miles. I don't really want to do five miles tonight, but I know what Dave Norris is like. He's a nightmare. Um, but yeah, we'll see. Hopefully. Um, yeah, we'll see. But yeah, it should be a good night. Looking forward to it. Get out on the old treaders. What are you doing, Millie? What are you doing? Don't go and wind Charlie up. Such a little bitch, he winds him up. Chuck her out there with him. He wouldn't do nothing to her. All he would want to do was play. But she just don't like it. So, yeah, there you go. But yeah, it's been a pucker day at the shop. Did, um, what did I do today? I did two iPhone 5s, an iPhone 4 with a back as well. Quite a few accessories, an unlock, I think. Yeah, someone come and pick their phone up, yeah. And tomorrow's already looking pretty good because I've got another phone to repair, which I'm getting the screen for tonight, Samsung Galaxy S4. One and a half, mate, one and a half, and that's going to cost him. I'm not even making super money out of it either. I'll tell you how much, the screen's cost me £115. So all I'm making out of it, what's that, it's uh, 35 quid. Which ain't a lot, really. Bearing in mind, I, that's the main reason why I'm going to pick the screens up. So it's going to cost me a tenner in petrol. So yeah, 25 quid out of it. And to, to do one of them, that's a lot of money. Because if I break that screen putting that in, then that's £115 that I've got to get back. So people don't realise this when, they, when they're on about, oh, it's really expensive. We're not making super money on, the, on Samsung's. Everywhere's expensive. Everywhere's that kind of money. 115 quid for a screen. It's stupid, isn't it? That's an S4. Yeah, and I've got an S3 to do, hopefully. They best come in because I've already... I've taken no deposit on that. <coughs> I've taken deposit on the, on the S4. So best come in for that S3 tomorrow as well. I've already got the screen for that. That come through the other day. That's 115 quid. And I think the screen's cost me 85 quid. Crazy, isn't it? And I'm only making 30 on that. But yeah. Such a life. But no, it's um, been pretty, it's, well, it's been a really good day today. Touch with it, it'll be a good day tomorrow. Someone broke their iPhone, um, come in last week, had a screen done on it, and um, he bought a flip case to protect it. So I said, that's the best thing for protection. Not 100%, mate, you, your phone's going to be perfect. And he's, and he's going to smash it. And he Facebooked me, get out of the way, Millie, leave him alone. And uh, yeah, he's Facebook me saying, um, is there any kind of warranty on them? I opened the case and it smashed. F screens don't just smash on their own, unless you've got it in heat or something like that. Um, there's always a reason. So and it's not as if it's been fitted wrong because it's one unit. So so I said, no, sorry, mate, it's not. He said, basically said, um, can you do me a screen any cheaper as I've had it done 10 days ago? So I said, yeah, I'll do it for 50 quid instead of 59.99, which I think is really nice of me. And he appreciated it as well. So I'm happy, he's happy. And I think he's going to try and get in tomorrow. Otherwise, it's going to have to be next week. But no. Nah. At the end of the day, he had to ask whether there was any warranty. But no, it's not, no, not on smash, it's not. Well, it's not a smash, it's a crack apparently. But still, same thing, innit? I'll have a look at the crack and it, you'll see where the impact was anyway. Usually, it always shows where the impact was. Unless there's loads of little smashes, and then you'll still probably see where it's come from, coming from. Probably be a corner, or right in the, usually right in the middle of the phone they go, right in the middle, on the left hand side or the right hand side. Yeah, so there you go. Out on the bike ride, Darren Sweet in. He's joined the he's joined the gang. Just about get me knee down. <laughs> he's loving it. Just going down Ham Road, ooh, 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 ooh. loads of flies, mmm, tasty. Just like having dessert, mmm, it's tidy. 
Now, the sun's gone now, now it's got it's turned into a. It's not cold. It's not cold, but it's not hot anymore. But it's, no, it's probably chish right for me. It means I ain't gonna get too hot. Oh, bloody hell, there's shit. Oh my god. There's loads of flies. I've got to stop talking because I wasn't really eat, eating them, choking. Two drunken bums. <laughs> We've been discussing toes. Toes? Toes? Yeah. What, foot fetishes? <laughs> look at, look at Lauren's no, toes. No, leave my poor toes alone. What's wrong with her toes? Look at this, that right. No. This is a perfect line. But she's got a fat toe. No, I'm Egyptian. That's Egyptian. And look at this one. Look at this big one. Oh, let's Where? get your man toes out. <laughs> man toes. So they've got right. geezer toes. I am Greek. We booked it up. She, apparently she's Greek. Already because my second toe is bigger than my she's, first toe. She's not. She's webbed. She's, oh, not. she's, she's in webbed. Her. Spread your feet out. Like Look a duck. She is. Like a duck. How many bottles of wine have you had, your winos? Just one. Just one and a half. One and a half. <laughs> Just one and a half. Hello, boy. It's his birthday tomorrow. It's his birthday, Charlie. It's your birthday tomorrow. Got, um, have some birthday drinks. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday, Charlie. What's it for you? Poor boy. Do you want a beer? You're not allowed one. Yeah, I can see that. Where's it from? Molly's. Uh, Millie's got a blue tag as well. We painted it on her. <laughs> we we don't even know if she's yeah, had got blue on there. Pen, Molly's room. She's Which, laid on it. Oh, she laid in it. Mm. There's Darren Sweet him. Yeah, got the fire guy. Steve weren't there. He forgot. Steve weren't there. Darren, let's take it. Oh, no, no, it's the I've got the stuff. <laughs> let's have a look at your toes, Phil. Let's have a look at yours, Phil. Wait for your toes out. Yeah. No, we've, let me get the thing up on the phone. Simon's in the toes. You Come on, then. I'll do it in a minute. Oh, I've got quite nice toes. Look at that. <laughs> you Egyptian. So. Uh, mm, yeah, but his he's, um, middle, the second one is still quite long. Not as long as yours. A lot, a lot of people's it's second tall. toe is longer than their big yeah, toe, isn't it? Yeah, see? What is Greek. That Greek. That's me. I'm a Greek. I like being Egyptian, though. I feel like a mummy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's film this one. <laughs> Just in case. Oh, sorry. <coughs> I'm dead. Ariel's coming! <laughs> She's just singing me. She's drunk. Yeah, I can tell that. Get her another glass. She's quite funny when she's drunk. She don't get drunk often. Uh, no, what are you doing? Don't you oh, it's working now. Oh, can you connect four, Darren? No way. Come for his own step ten side. Look at you, couple of fucking kisses, didn't they? We've only been out an hour. We had Oreo crush them. No way. You could have got me in. No. Oh, it's coming to get you. Yeah, look at that beetle. Oh, oh there, look. Oh, look at it. It's coming to get you. Could have got me in. I'd beat with Paul, I think. Wait, one flew over earlier. The girls went mental. What? Down by the old fire. Exactly. Sitting by the old fire. Sitting there by the old fire, boy. My boy. Anyway, I'm ending, the, I'm ending the vlog here. Hope you've enjoyed today's vlog. Thumbs up the video. What have I got to do, Lauren? Thumbs up. Thumbs up. And subscribe to what? I don't know. Sit, <laughs> sit down here somewhere. <laughs> that one? That one? Yeah. Subscribe one. to see subscribe what? Subscribe buttons what? here to watch more uh, videos from Paul Samuel. Me and my family. <laughs> <laughs> see you tomorrow.